Greenpeace. Mm -hmm. Yes. What did you think about Greenpeace? It, I, it was not an RV resort. It was a campground. You know what? It wasn't. It was mostly people that lived there. People that lived there. So I don't, I don't really know what you call it. It was inexpensive rent for people to live at. Yes. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Yeah. It wasn't really like you say an RV park. Mm -mm. No, there was no amenities that you could. Right. Uh, showers or restrooms. They had the basic needs: water hookup and power. Right. Yeah. That's. But okay. it was, and there's kind of a. I don't know. It's kind of a good thing about that. Like, it's thirty-five dollars a night. You're right. There's your spot. Mm -hmm. Right. Go get in it. Right. And we had no intentions of living there. No. So it was perfect right. for what we needed. Yeah, and it was fun. Yeah. yeah. It was quiet. It wasn't rowdy. It wasn't. No, know. it wasn't rowdy at all. Mm -mm. And your every day worker got up and went to, went work. to work. Yeah. So it was a different experience from what we had for the previous two weeks, but yet it provided the needs that we had. Absolutely. A couple of days, uh, you know, and the, the guy that did it, they didn't send any confirmation number by email, any, nothing no, like that. No just, hassle whatsoever. No, mm -mm. just show up and give me my money. There's your spot. Yeah. Have fun. Yeah. No bathhouse, no laundry, no nothing. Yeah. But it was cheap. Yep. And the guy answered the phone and yeah. any questions or whatever, it was fine. But no problem. I don't know that I would necessarily camp there again. Like I wouldn't seek that park out to go camp. Mm -hmm. But it was fine for what we needed for. Right. Just a place to lay your hat for mm -hmm. a night or two. To get off That's the road. It. Yeah. All right. That's all I got unless y'all got something else. No, I don't think so. No. Good. Okay.